all eyes on one man. He's been in terrific form as evidenced by four goals in three games. Stay with us. Hello everyone, great to be with you from Stamford Bridge. I'm Derek Ray, your match commentator, and alongside providing all the tactical analysis is Stuart Robson. And it's all about action from the Premier League in this case. It is Chelsea versus Everton. Well, Derek, when looking forward to this game, you can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the pitch, particularly in those central areas. Whichever team wins more of those battles will win the game. And a look at the Chelsea starting 11. Aspini Quetta plays with Ben Chilwell in the fullback positions. N'Golo Conte starts alongside Kai Havertz in central midfield. And the idea is to have just the one striker up there trying to pose problems for the opposition. getting anxious when they have the ball and here's how Everton line up Jordan Pickford stands between the posts Abdoulaye Dukure plays alongside Alan in central midfield and rather than use a strike partnership they've gone with just the one player in attack and a chance to whip it in here a really intense pressure applied and a goal right off the bat no wonder they're jumping for joy. Well, here it is again, and credit to the goal scorer, but you have to ask questions of the keeper. He's got to have that near post cover for me. No wonder he's frustrated with himself. So Everton restart the game, well aware that the pressure has been applied. How will they respond? It will be. It is to be a throw-in. That was interesting to look at the table. And what can we say about these runner? They got a good palm on it. Corner kick forthcoming. And delivering Sigurdsson, and still dangerous. And the counter looks on here, options available. Can the owner of the red That's very effective, good high pressing. Great effort to keep that one in play. Thank you. The cross is on. It's part of his game, holding the ball up and waiting for teammates to arrive on the scene. Is it going to be? Oh, it's a penalty! Just what they wanted to avoid, given the scoreline. Well, some might say he's been fortunate to avoid being shown the card. Well, I like that from the referee. Just because it's a penalty doesn't mean it's a yellow card. I think he's got it right. Can they extend their lead? And a fine stop. He's got the right idea with that pass. Oh, brilliant goalkeeping. Who can he pick out? Straight forward for the keeper. Right, just hearing a goal has gone in at Anfield. Let's get the details from Alex. It's a goal for Newcastle. They're back level. It's one all with 28 minutes played. Thank you, Alex. Can he finish this? And it's in! All square again. What a match this is turning out to be. Well, let's see this again. The vision to play this through ball is superb. And then the finish is fairly simple in the end. That's a good goal.
So back underway following the equaliser. Kai Havertz. And does well to keep it in play. Everton moving the ball forwards. What can they do from here? Pulls it back. Alan. Well, he likes to run at them. And return to Alan. Ducouré. That's a useful cross. It comes to absolutely nothing. Well, as the stats confirm, Chelsea have controlled the ball. But unless they find some inspiration from somewhere, I'm not sure where the winner will come from. They certainly need to up the tempo. And news of a goal at Anfield. Alex Scott has all the information for us. Yep, it's his second goal for Newcastle United. Nice build-up play, and when the space opened up, boy, did he take it well. It's now 2-1 with 42 minutes played. Alex keeping us right up to date. Havertz. And so the first half draws to a close here in West London. Underway then in the second half. And the two teams matching each other just about stride for stride. Matt Doherty. On the ball, Richarlison. He will be keeping the ball moving. Applying vigorous pressure. Ducouré went in strongly to win the ball. Well, this is the home of live football, EA TV, and we have more action coming up from the Premier League for you. It's Chelsea facing Wolves. This is looking threatening. And a long way out here, and a fine stop. So making the substitution now. Number 17, Alex Ilobi. To be replaced by number 19, James Rodriguez. And delivering Sigurdsson. On a corner like that, every goalkeeper's dream, really. Bodies forward, and the break looks on. Werner and the ball's gone James Rodriguez on and on he goes oh magnificent reaction Aspiliqueta here's Mount and we have more live Premier League action coming up for you soon on EA TV. It's Everton taking on Leicester City. And news of a goal at Anfield. Let's hear more from Alex Scott. It's another for Newcastle United. It's now 3-1 with 67 minutes played. What a game of football we have on our hands here today, Derek. Many thanks as ever, Alex. Time for a change then. James Rodriguez. Richarlison. And that's an important intervention. Malong Saar. Well, they've lost possession of the ball. I must say, this looks promising. Under pressure. Doesn't seem to be bothering him. 
Well, it looks so promising, but a goal kicked the outcome. Ducure. The pass could do damage. Just unable to take advantage of that developing situation. Ten minutes to go. Well, Everton will probably get one more big chance to win this game, and don't these fans... Now, hold on, Stuart. They're in here. Might still be able to do a bit of damage. And a goal! This is why we adore this game. Late drama, and now they're in front. Well, here it is again. He's alive to the situation. He makes good contact with the ball, and he keeps it down. That's a nice-headed goal. Well, a dramatic moment near the end might well be the decider we might very well have late excitement here five minutes to go and just one goal between them how can they find a late leveler and credit is due for that good piece of defending Conte and habits and we will have a couple of additional minutes at the end here and what can they do to stop him running at them and with that the attack fizzles out and there goes the final whistle no cause for celebration in the Everton camp a defeat for them here what did you make of it well, Derek, I thought it was a really intense game. Lots of quality, lots of good individual displays, but in the end, they will not be happy with the defeat and the manner of it.